Specifically, I did, because I had sheen credit, so I went and got more clothes. I kind of know my way around sheen now. I would dare say I'm a sheen expert. Totally lying. But anyways, um, yeah, so we are going to do another sheen haul. I'm so excited, I used all my money. This is the first dress, it's a size small, it's super cute. Again, I'm gonna kill myself with the editing. <laughs> And I'm drinking peach bellini, courtesy of Trader Joe's. This video is sponsored by Trader Joe's. Just kidding, I freaking wish. Um, but I'm gonna go on to the outfits now and I'll show you what I got this time around. Hopefully it's better than last time, but I have a feeling, guys. I have a good, good... Why am I, why am I like Tina Belcher? Baby girl was draped in Chanel. I have a good, good feeling. Look at that. Yeah, this is cute. My pose wasn't, but... And it does have like a slit for some like Hey, I'm Pocahontas <laughs> It's kind of cute. I like the off the shoulder. I feel like one of those girls in the tampon commercials who's like Oh my god, it's so flowy. I love that my vagina is bleeding. Sorry if that's TMI. Actually, I'm not <gasps> Oh, that's that's spicy Kind of like me <laughs> Anyways I think it fits well too. I mean, yeah, I'm not mad at it. I mean, I do kind of look like a pilgrim, but like a sexy pilgrim, like. Hey, John Smith. Wait, no, that's Pocahontas. Wait, but the pilgrims had Thanksgiving with the Native Americans. But the pilgrims were bad people, so maybe like I shouldn't associate with pilgrims. Am I gonna get canceled for that? Whatever. Anyways. This is my sexy pilgrim dress. I'm not mad at it. It reminds me of New Girl when Jess is like, I'm just a sexy farmer's daughter. Oh, I'm going to go milk my cows. It's kind of like that vibe. And like, so, <laughs> you know, the thing about me is I don't like to learn my lesson the first time. I like to look again and say, actually, this is really cute. Cause I'm the model, it's really cute. But I'm not the model, I mean, Jelly. Why do I want to be a pilgrim? Maybe it's the effect of Thanksgiving or something on me. Hmm. Like, it's just. It's like Moo Moo Grandma meets again Sexy Pilgrim. Why do I want to be a sexy pilgrim so bad? Is this subconscious? <laughs> I don't, it's like such a weird cut here. It's like. When I do that, it looks okay, but I can't walk around like this, like a freaking Lego person. I mean, I could. Ooh. All right, sorry, sorry, distracted. This part has a weird cut, like it's like, this part is loose and this part is not loose and then this part is weird and it's the sleeves. I'm sick of being a colonial man. Like I, ugh. my hair looks good though. I feel like one of those Garnier Fruities per people look. You know what I mean? Because it's so freaking bouncy, yo! Look at that hair glow up. Sorry, this video is not about hair, but it's also not about this dress, fam. This is just not it. Uh -huh. <laughs> this was by far my most expensive purchase on Sheen. Why do I want to be burned so bad? Like, I think I'm a phoenix. Like, why do, do I pick sleeves like this? Because, like, when I look back, I'm like, no, fam. I look like a figure skater. I look like Jimmy McElroy and like Blades of Glory. Oh my god! It just looks so much better in the picture. Like when you look at it up close in person, it's like it's like a stripper cougar meets ice skating. And it looks so cute on these girls, but like on me it's weird. And it's like really short in the cooch area and then like Long everywhere else, but I it also look like I could like fight dragons. Like, I guess personified, this dress is kind of me because it's everywhere. everywhere. Like, this shit is everywhere. It doesn't know what it wants to be. Does it want to be a Moulin Rouge corset or does it want to be Shrek's slaying dragon? Even though Shrek's not red, but you know, it's it's like Shrek because this dress has layers. A lot, a lot of layers. Too many layers. There's a lot to unpack here. <laughs> 
There's a lot to unpack here. What's next on your list, Rachel? Another fucking flower dress, obviously. Why did I order so many flower dresses? Like, I was it subconscious? And I don't know what these are for. I have little ties, but I don't remember. Am I supposed to like do that? Why is it so complicated? This is like Avril Lavigne in a dress because why do you have to go and make things so complicated? <laughs> Wait, I mean, I'm not actually mad at it. I'm just trying to figure out how you're supposed to tie these things. Like what is, <laughs> why do I want to be a pilgrim so mad? <laughs> like I really, really wanted to ride it on the Mayflower. Is it, it's like, and what are these strings for? How do I do this? <laughs> I know this is not how it is, but this is how I want it to be. Can you imagine? It's a headband and a dress in one. Oh yeah. That's, <laughs> that's where it's at. Oh! Oh! Wow. I'm smart. Well, hey, it worked. My headband thing works. So it like ties behind here. It is cute in a weird way i guess that's my brand because i'm like cute when i'm weird i look in the mirror i'm not mad at it i don't know when i would wear it but <laughs> why do i want to be a sexy farmer so bad <laughs> i think after my tinder video where i talk about like wanting to be on farmers only or christian mingle i'm like christian mingle but with some spice <laughs> like farmers only with like it's sassy <laughs> was i think on sale so i'm not mad and my body is like okay in it like i'm not mad like i feel like it's like an apron a little bit but i kind of like that i don't know i have weird i have some weird taste i feel like i could wear this somewhere i just am unsure where i could definitely wear it in my living room but i haven't gone farther than that so <laughs> My spoon is too big. It's like not zipping. <laughs> 4K. Maybe that's why it was on sale. Maybe I gained weight again. Like the first year I lost weight, nothing fit. And now it's like. <sighs> so I get it. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay. Okay, okay. Two seconds later. Lesson with Shein. This is the same stitch. Like, it's like, ah! I mean, I don't hate it. It's just like not as cute. And it's supposed to be like a Hello Kitty theme dress. I mean, I guess it's a cute little summery thing. Like, I guess I could wear it to like the park. I just have to start going to the park now. Because <laughs> this is like such a quintessential park girl, Zoe de Chanel, 500 Days of Summer dress. I mean, it's cute. I'm really not mad at it. I feel like. I just feel like a blob. Like when I look into the lens, it feels like it's like photoshopped on my body. Like it looks like a green screen. Is this a simulation? Well, if it is, I'm doing really fucking well. So cheers to that. Yeah, I mean, maybe with a belt. Maybe with a belt. Maybe with a belt to work it. Yeah, yeah. It's just, it's it for me. So this is cute. This is cute. This is cute. This is cute. I don't know if that's how it goes, but this is freaking cute. Like I buy vintage dresses on Amazon for like $25, $30. And I think this was on sale for way less. Again, machine, it's not like a perfect fit because it's not like it's your measurements, but I really like this. And I have a little like, a, what the thing, like a petticoat? God, I, why we I'm like a 50 year old woman. <laughs> I'm sorry, I was born in the wrong decade, but like I can put it under this and make it more like floofy and vintage. Let me get it actually now. I'm going to try it. This is my floofy petticoat, and I'm gonna put it under this and see wow, how floofy it really is. I love the floof. I love the floof. Okay. It's kind of cute, it kind of matches. I look like a cupcake. I just love this style. It could be a little tighter here, a little more down. I love vintage style. I think it's super cute. I know it's not for everyone, but like sometimes when I feel like dressing up a little proper, I go to tea house, go to the sport, hit it up. I feel like a spice girl. <laughs> yeah, I'll tell you what I want, what I really, really want. Tell me, tell me what you want, what you really want. <laughs> yeah, it's cute. I'm not mad at this. Listen. <laughs> Please don't ask 
me why? I ordered so much floral. Because I honestly have no idea. Like, I don't remember if I was, like, drinking when I ordered, but I don't, like, for some reason, my subconscious was like, you know what you should do with all the Shein credit? You should order five flower dresses. Because <laughs> they're all floral. But I actually like this one. I think this was on sale, too. And it's cute. It's cute. I'm not gonna front. This actually might be one of my favorite ones. I feel cute. I look cute. Uh, I could wear it off the shoulder. I don't know. This is a park dress too. I I like it. I like it a lot. Uh, oh. No, it's not a rich bitch dress, but it's like it's cute girl dress. Like hey, I'm cute girl. <laughs> I don't know what to say. So the next few items I bought are shirts. But this is kind of cute. I'm not mad at it. This part is super like... Like, it feels like football <laughs> on my boots. And I don't know why, but I feel like I could literally like put on a helmet and go play football and I'd be fine if anyone was like... <clears throat> anyone just like... Mm, like elbowed me in the boob. Which I don't know why they would, but that did happen to me in like seventh grade. Although I didn't have boobs then. So like, it didn't really hurt. It's just like, ah, my epidermis. I'm sorry, I really don't think before I speak and I just end up saying weird shit. Mm, it's kind of like office chic. It fits pretty good. It's still a little loose, but like, I, I like it. I like it. I already had the skirt, by the way, so it's just the top. But we're gonna try on some more tops. You're gonna let me know what you like. You gotta let me know. I'm sorry. But what the fuck is this top? Oh my God, I look like an 80s dance video. Like. Oh, and like, there's, it's the opposite of the, like, the hockey, the football pad shirt. There is no padding here. It's just like, literally wire, like under wire, but no, no, like, protection. <gasps> it's so weird. It's such a weird fit. Maybe if I tuck it in, but like, ew. This is like my Amazon wish moment, like from the last video. This is not at all what I expected. Why? Why? What is happening on the neckline? Honestly, this is the one. I thought I got better. I thought I knew Shein. I thought I was an expert. I was like, yep, I know how it works now. I read the reviews. But you really don't know, dude. None of the reviews said this. Like, I... <sighs> My Karen is coming out right now because I need to speak to the manager. I'm the manager. Yeah, it's going to be a hard no. And for that reason, I'm out. All right, not gonna lie, I was pissed. I was mad, I was like, Sheen, what the fuck? But like, then look at this. Look, look at this! Oh, this is such a cute top. This is such a cute top. For the price, it's so cute. I really love it. I know we're like out of summer and we're going into winter, but like, man, like this is just, ah! Uh. It's just like so like adorable. I really, really like this. Shein kind of redeemed themselves. I know I'm everywhere, but honestly. Shein is like a roller coaster. Like life is like a box of Shein. Cause you really never know what you're gonna get. And like, this is like a peanut butter truffle. Cause I love peanut butter. And the other thing was like an oatmeal raisin bagel. <laughs> but this is cute! Look how cute! <laughs> All right, so this is a body suit. It's a suit for your body. It's like a birthday suit, but a little bit of body. <laughs> but it's cute. Obviously, I'm not gonna show with the skirt off because some of you guys are straight up herbs. Okay, and I know. You don't think I know? I know, and I hope you feel guilty right now because you're probably just watching this video to be a perv and I'm calling you out. <laughs> Anyways, this is cute. I love their bodysuits. I will say, A1. A1 steak sauce, A1 day one. I'm here for it. Amazing, immaculate, the best performance of my career. Fantastic, I don't know, overwhelming, lovely. Put it in a blender, shit on it, vomit on it. If I ever went out, ever, which I don't, but if I did, I could wear this bodysuit with some jeans, you know. I could make a cute outfit, I could make something work, okay? Something work, but the only thing that's working right now is me. Because I don't know life, because all I do is work. 
and film YouTube videos. Alone in my living room. It's fine. I'm fine. All right. Cool. Okay. Rachel, do you really mean to tell me that you bought another floral white and blue <laughs> bodysuit? Really? Yes. Apparently. Yes, I did. And you know what? It's freaking cute. I still like it. I stand by my choice to buy the same item 50 times in five different colors. That are barely like different colors. And if people are colorblind watching this, I'm really sorry because it looks like I'm wearing the same clothes over and over. And I promise you it's just because apparently I'm basic when I order clothes. But like, I like this. I like this. I like, I like this look. I think it's a good look. I would never compare myself to Ariana Grande because she's perfect. But like, if I did a high pony and was like, and I want that to go. Head in the crowd, got no way. Please erase that from your brain. I'm already erasing it from mine. This, my friends, Rachel, sober Rachel, she's not good. Is it supposed to be off the shoulders? Shoulders. Oh, oh, oh. Pajamas and body suits. Dare I say? They're immaculate. Incredible. These are soft. They're comfy. I feel cute. I just wish they're going out day clothes where other people could see me were just as cute. But when I look at myself in these, I'm like, damn, she cute. Because this looks like Victoria's Secret style with dollar store price. And I am here for it. Oh! Oh! Oh, I feel like I could like... Like a Victoria, <laughs> no, I'm not Victoria's Secret model, but like, you know, like when they're doing their sleepwear and they're just like. <laughs> they look like fancy horses walking because their posture's good and they're just like. I don't know, maybe it's just my brain. My ADD. My ADD. But look, look at it. Would you just, would you just look at it? I'm not crazy about the weird way this is like sprinkled down just like he's gonna make a little bow and pretend that it's a real tie even though it's attached to literally nothing oh that looks like a <laughs> division sign it looks like a division sign see but no either way i don't care it's cute it's comfy i can wear these shorts and shirt to bed all the time all the time If you have watched my Shein part one, you'll recognize this dress. This dress had fish energy. Shark energy. But you know what it has now? It has the big fish energy. B-F-E, baby! Because I went back and I was like, you know what? I'm not going to alter it. I'm just going to order the extra small. Woo! Boy, am I glad I did. Do I have any rich uh, friends who want me to escort them to a ball? I don't know. Like, this just makes me feel like... <laughs> Winston! Bring the car around immediately. Or like a James Bond, like, female villain archetype, like... The name's... Princess Consuela Banana Hammock. James. Princess Consuela Banana Hammock. It just made me feel hot. I'm not gonna lie, I'm not gonna front. It took me a long time to be this confident, and it took me a long time to start loving all of this. So, when I wear something, that shows that shit off. Girl! Girl, you better know that I'm gonna work it. Oh, I'm obsessed with it. Hey. Yeah, I went on the yacht this weekend. <clears throat> Sorry, I'm becoming pretentious already, but like, this dress makes me feel like, oh, your new money. <laughs> like, I don't know, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I just freaking love it. I'm so glad I decided to go back and get a smaller size because it does fit perfectly, like, I'm here for it. And I have another dress, my second one, that's also like a redo. And we'll see if that fits a little better. All right, and if you watched the last haul, you'll also remember this dress, but I also got this in a smaller size, and it's cute. I am here for it. And of course, it's a fucking flower dress. Like, that's just everything I'm buying, apparently. The last time I had like a lot of low cut items, so I think this time I'm like, you know what? I'm just gonna, I'm still gonna be sexy, but maybe pilgrim, pilgrim style, Mayflower sexy, you know, like, Virginia 1700 sexy. Nothing sexy about like what was going on at that time. 
Like I say, I was born in the wrong decade. I mean for fashion, not for like life, because God, I would not have done well there. I'm barely doing well here. Hey, just kidding. Doing fantastic. I'm great. Actually, I am. I'm just like to make fun of myself. Yeah, I'm a fan of this. This is cute. It fits better. It looks better. You guys have to invite me out to things so I can show off my style. Because what? I feel like I'm glowing up. Glowing up. But anyways, speaking of glowing up. My next video and my first video series is going to be how to glow up. I'm going to talk about spiritually, mentally, holistically, physically, everything. Just because I have gone through a huge transformation this year. I'm super proud of it. So it's going to be from my specific point of view how I did it and maybe it'll help you guys out. It's not my usual style, but I just feel called to do it because I really have had the best year of my life. And I have a lot of you to thank for it. Thank you guys so much again for all your love and support. It means the absolute world to me when you like, comment, subscribe. It shows me like what I'm doing and I really enjoy creating content and it's completely free. So I really appreciate it. Um, and I just have a really good time with you guys. So hopefully you enjoyed this video. Either way, I'll see you next time in my series. If you want to follow me, look inside the description below. I never know how to end this song. He knows me well.